What's up, YouTube? It's your boy T Sizzle back for another video. And for today's video, I'm gonna do a rant on Batman. Now, listen, Batman is my favorite DC character. He's my favorite DC character, and I think maybe my second favorite is Superman. But Batman is my favorite. I like Batman because he's dark, he's mysterious, uh, he wears all black, um, he's smart as shit. He's a you know he he's a detective. He's smart as fuck. He got all this tech, and he's just he's just a badass. I fuck with him. Uh, he's he, he he's an introvert. He stays to himself. He doesn't really like talking like that. I fuck with him. You know he's a loner. You know just like myself, I'm a loner. Like you know, I, and he's rich as fuck, and he gets all the bitches. <laughs> Been fucking cat woman for years. <laughs> Catwoman, fine as fuck, wearing all that black ass leather. I'll fuck shit out of Catwoman. Shit, fucking Catwoman and shit. He fuck Catwoman, Wonder Woman, all these motherfucking hoes, man. Shit, and he, he a billionaire, he rich as fuck too. Got a butler and all that shit. He dope as fuck. But, we, but I'm gonna do a rant on Batman, man, because some of this shit, man, is just ridiculous, man. Dogs, motherfucking Tom's damn air. It's air to be loud, I gotta turn this shit off. Yeah, some of this shit does be ridiculous, man. It does be ridiculous. Like, okay. Batman is supposed... Okay. Basically, story goes, his parents get shot, whatever, and he fucking becomes a superhero to take, you know, to keep the, keep the streets safe and make sure that that doesn't happen to no one else and he just wants to be a fighter of justice. You know, because he felt the pain of loss. So he he doesn't want no one else to feel the pain of loss. So he took up the name Batman and he goes kicking people's asses. And that's and that's dope. No wrong with that. But Batman originally is just supposed to be a regular human who's just smart and knows how to fight. Now, obviously, this is fiction. This is fiction. So he's obviously going to be way better than like the average man in real life. So this is fiction. So he's still way above the average motherfucking man, but they they made him in a way to where, yes, he's way above the average man, but in a way, but he's not like, it's not super, 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 super unrealistic. Yeah, it's still fiction. So obviously they can't make him be completely at the same strength as a human because that would be trash and he wouldn't be able to... to to do to do to do to do none of the shit that he does, so obviously they don't put him at the exact level of a human being. He's still way above it, but at the same time, they somewhat keep it realistic to a certain level. Batman, like, what the fuck, my phone? I had, it. I just had it. Like, like when you like, but now like they even having Batman. Do all sorts of insane shit. Like they they make him too too overpowered at times. When you like read some of the things he does in comic books, it's like too overpowered. Like for example, okay, Batman is in the Justice League, and I typed in Justice League members. These are all the Justice League members. Um, you have Aquaman, Martian Manhunter. Wonder Woman, Superman, The Flash, Zatanna, Batman, Green Arrow, Black Canary, Captain Marvel, Doctor Fate, Red Tornado, Hawkman, Hal Jordan, Captain Autumn, Hawk Girl, Autumn, John Stewart, Vixen, Firestorm, Booska. Some of these motherfuckers I don't even know. Booster Gold, Robin. Okay, so he's in the Justice League, right? Realistically, Batman should be one of the weakest members of the fucking Justice League. Realistically. But they make it to where he's like on par with Superman. Like they make it to where he's like on, they make it to where he's on par with Superman. Realistically, most characters should be able to kick Batman's ass. Uh, Aquaman should be able to whoop Batman's ass or, you know, Batman's ass. Martian Manhunter, Wonder Woman, definitely. Superman, definitely. The Flash, definitely. Niggas, do you know how fucking fast the Flash is? Even if Batman's way smarter, the Flash can easily fuck Batman up, you know, with his speed, you know. So Flash, Zatanna, she got magic powers. She should be able to fuck him up. Batman could probably be Cyborg. 
Batman could probably be Green Arrow. Black Canary, I don't know too much about her like that. Captain Marvel, Captain Marvel is like a Superman fucking 2.0. He should be able to fuck Batman up. Green Lantern, definitely. Should be able to be Batman. Dr. Face should be able to be Batman. Red Tornado. I see him before. Um, I don't really know that much about him, but I think uh, he should be able to be Batman as well. Hawkman. Um, Batman maybe could find a way to beat him. I don't know. Hal Jordan, that's Green Lantern again. Yes, he should be able to beat him as well. Captain Autumn, I don't really know too much about him. Hawk Girl, he can probably be Hawk Girl maybe if he put something together. Um, basically, most of motherfuckers should be at what Batman's ass. He should be low tier Justice League level. How the fuck? But they make him to where he's like on par with Superman. Now I fuck with Batman, but when you find out, when you be looking at some of these things he be doing, it's just ridiculous, man. You know, it's it's it, it's it's just stupid, man. He shouldn't be able to do all that. You know, like there's one time where he fucking fell from outer, like like he he fell from outer space. He fell from outer space onto Earth, and he still survived. And he he fell from space to Earth. He was catching on fire. He crashed and lands on Earth, and he still come. And he still gets back up, and he survived the the impact. It, it, it's ridiculous, man. It's, it's stupid. It's dumb. You know they're just making him overpowered just so he can keep up with all the main villains. So. They can put him in more comics and put him in more fights because he's like the most popular. I think he's, I think Superman's the most popular, but he's the second most popular fucking DC character. So they want to keep him, keep him as relevant as possible. So they overpower him and shit. Like they said some shit like, oh, Batman knows, Batman knows. Like, if I'm not mistaken, he knows 300 martial arts. He knows 300 martial arts and stuff. And it's like, it's like, okay, this is fiction. It's fiction. So I can't apply real world logic to it because technically, like, there's, there's, there's only so many times. There's only so many ways that you can throw a punch. You can either throw a jab, an uppercut, a hook. You know, there's only so many ways to throw a punch. And the same thing goes for a kick. So how the fuck that? So what? He knows 300 ways to throw a punch? There's only a few ways to throw a fucking punch. You throw a jab, uppercut, hook, you know. Like, what else? Like, I don't know, man. I mean, it's fiction. So, you know, I can't really apply real world logic to it. But it, it, it's just they just overdo. They just overpower Batman sometimes, man. And, it, and, and you know, Batman's not supposed to be that strong. He's he not supposed to be doing that. He's, he's still a human being. He can't do this shit, man. Come on, man. He's just supposed to be able to take out street punks. And if it is someone stronger than him, it's because he has some sort of gadget, some sort of tech that can counter their ability or some shit. Not because he's some... Because, it, like, S Superman and Batman are two different people. Batman's supposed to win because of his brain. Superman's supposed to win because of his strength. They're making Batman win fights because, yeah, I'm more stronger than you, nigga. I'm stronger than you, bitch. Yeah, I'm, I'm strong. Nigga, that's Superman shit. He you, you supposed to win because you got this. Like Shikamaru and Naruto, how he's not the strong, but he got the best IQ. That's how you're supposed to win your fights. Batman, you're not supposed to be winning fights because, yeah, I'm more stronger. Yeah. Now, yes, there's people he, that he can beat by pure strength, like the Joker. Or fucking, uh, who, who, who's another motherfucker? that He can probably whoop, whoop their ass with hand-to-hand -hand combat. Joker. Uh, who else? Fucking, um, maybe he, maybe he can kind of... Go toe to toe with Deathstroke a little bit, you know, because Deathstroke is kind of a human as well, but he has like he's like he has enhancements on him and shit. Um, but you supposed to win with your brain, my nigga, not your fucking strength. So they're just overpowering Batman. It's annoying, you know. You know, like I I just hate when these fucking companies they always ruin characters by fucking trying to keep. It's all about money. So you fucking ruin a character or make a character less appealing 
because you want to keep them relevant. Oh, we can't just have Batman fighting regular street punks. We, we have to have him fighting fucking aliens and fuck. Now it's still it, now 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 it's it's still cool as shit to see Batman fight aliens. I'm not saying that's not. I'm not saying that's ass. It's, it's still dope. Cause I can I believe I, uh, there's a movie. It's called it's called it's it's his movie called Superman and Batman. And it's dope as shit. And Batman and Superman are fighting aliens. It's actually fire. It's it's actually dope as fuck. But I'm just saying. It's like, realistically, how the fuck can he fight these top-ass niggas? Like, how the fuck is he fighting these strong-ass motherfuckers? He he should be like the weakest of the Justice League, bro. Like, when, when you make a character, you have to have a character have a weakness. You can't just make a character be too overpowered. Because if a character is too overpowered, what's the fun in watching that? Because you know that they're never going to have a... You know that the situation is not going to be dire. You know that they're not going to have a struggle against any enemy. You know, like, you know they're not going to have a struggle against any opponent. You know, that's why I like One Punch Man. It's like, um, uh, like, I'm watching... Well, I'm finna, I'm finna start watching it. It's like, why well, watch a show of a dude who beats everybody with, with, with one punch? It's like, you know he's not going to really have a challenge. Because, it, I mean, I have to watch it. To really get an idea of what's going on, but I'm just saying, like, you can't make a you can't make a character be too damn overpowered. Superman is is overpowered than a motherfucker, but he has weaknesses like fucking kryptonite or magic. So that means if a person that faces him has those things, that's gonna give him a hard time. Like when he like when he fought Doomsday, with that's like my favorite Superman movie when he fought Doomsday, and Doomsday has magic. That's why he. That's why he was fucking Superman up. But he fucking almost killed his ass, you know, because he has magic, and Superman almost fucking died. Or he, or did he die? Did he did he die and come back to life, or did he actually die? Or did, or did, or did, did he or was he almost killed? That was a really that was a real good fight. Doomsday fucked Superman up, it, like fucked him up bad. So you gotta have a character have a weakness. You can't just. Like, you know, typically how it goes, like, for example, if a person is fast, they're not that strong. Or if a person is super strong, they're not that fast. Or a person is smart, but they're not that strong. Like, you know, like I said, Shikamaru, not the strongest, but he's the smartest. You know, you can't have a character just be every fucking box is checked out. Oh, you got this, 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 this. Nah, man, makes it fucking trash. Now, you know, nobody, no one can whoop his ass. Cause he, cause he checks every fucking box. You gotta have a character have a flaw or some sort of thing that can be uh, developed on. Like to have some sort of character development with, with a certain thing, with a certain weakness. You can't just have them fucking be a fucking god, you know, of every damn thing. Like for Dragon Ball Z, Goku's strong as shit, but he's a dumbass. <laughs> He's a dumbass. So some of the shit he does, he 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 fucking puts people at risk with some of his uh, dumb decisions, you know, stuff like that. So yeah, man, that's all I gotta say, man. Yeah, you gotta have a character have some flaws, man, or it makes the show not fucking be interesting. But don't get me wrong, I felt bad, man. My fa my favorite DC character, my favorite DC, but I'm just saying some of his feats are just unrealistic.